Yo, hello everyone and welcome back again to a brand new video. Empower your trade of it, trading strategies by synchronizing with TradingView in 2023. This tutorial educates the process allowing you to utilize TradingView's advanced tools alongside your Tradovate account. So guys, let's get started. Before we start with this video, make sure to watch it from now till the end so you have the full information. So, guys, here we are at Tradovate.zendesk.com and we are in an article that will explain to us how do I connect my Tradovate account to TradingView. So, the first thing is to sign up for their TradingView integration, navigate to application settings, as you can see right in front of you. Then click on the add-ons tab and it will be something like that and scroll down to find the TradingView add-on. Click buy to add it to your TradeOvet user account. The TradingView add-on will enable TradingView to access your TradeOvet account, both live and slim, to use in conjunction with TradeOvet install, web and mobile version. No additional order routine fees apply. A valid TradingView subscription is required. Once this add-on is enabled, you will be able to connect TradingView to your TradeOvet account with your current TradeOvet username and password. And password. Now, as you can see, you have to pay ten dollars to get to actually connect them together. After completing your purchase to go to Trading View, once you are logged in there, click the trading panel and select TradeOvet from the list that will be in the bottom. So it's going to be like that. We can go to trading view. Uh, here we go. And through here, I'm going, for example, to choose one of these markets. For example, choose crypto and choose Ethereum. And here I can simply head up to this full screen. And I will be finding here the trading panel. In this trading panel section, you can basically find all different kind of brokers. So, for example, there is Fox, uh, FX Open, Capital.com, Easy Markets, FC, FXCM, Paper Storm, Forex, and here we can click on Add, and we can add others. So now it's time to pick a broker. So you can choose to open an account in any one of these brokers. In your case, once you have bought and connected to it, you will find Try to wait over here. So the next thing to do is to simply click on it and then put your username and password and then click on connect. Your Tradovate account will now be available to be used within TradingView. Whatever market data subscriptions you have enabled in Tradovate will be applied to your TradingView chart. Please note that users must have a Tradovate market data subscription in order to view it on TradingView. You do not need TradingView data subscription. So yeah, you have to actually get data from Tradovate. So we can simply go to Tradovate like that and simply click on it, go to the pricing page, and you will have every single commissions. So here you, there is like two data uh, things. Basically, you either go for the 99 or the 1.5k. Uh, 1 uh, these are like mainly the plans that you should go for. Otherwise, uh, you shouldn't pay anything more. So in general, if you want, for example, for this 99, you will be having to pay hundred and ten dollars so you can have the data from Tradovate and at the same time you should have this add-on as they said here this add-on trading view add-on for ten dollars as well so you shouldn't pay anything in trading view even though trading view has its own uh, like plans so you can upgrade your plan like that and there is three different plans uh, I would like to go for the uh, trading view plans since they are much better you can have like two chart layouts four chart layout or eight chart layout at the same time there will be more indicators more circle bars and like more than one price alert but in general uh, in case you are just going to use trade of uh trade of it or you are let's say that you are used to it you don't want to change it well it is completely up to you guys you can simply keep using it as you would like to so this is basically on how you can connect my trade of it account to trading view now let's talk about a little bit on how and why we should actually connect them together so what is the purpose well, basically, if you want to trade of it, so let's try to go to trade of it, charts, and check how it looks like. And basically, the chart is looking like that. So 
it can be very, very hard to understand. Um, it can be also very hard for new people that doesn't know what these numbers mean. And it can be very hard to analyze. Well, on the other hand, if you want to uh, trade in view, you have this chart with green and red candles. You can have here indicators, which will help you a lot with all of these different indicators. There's all of these different strategies. For example, you can choose this one and you will find all the bar up or down, as you can see here. And go to indicators, you can see the, uh, for example, let's go to uh, SI strategies. So here we go, I'm going to click on it. And as you can see, there is the result up, result down here, there is also here. So basically they are going to analyze everything for you without having the biggest knowledge that you need to have in the first place to actually start trading. You will also have this kind of tools on the left. So there's this menu that will help you to draw th things on your graph. And this will be very helpful in case you would like to analyze the graph itself, draw some support, draw some resistance. Even if you don't know how to draw these things, you could simply just use this uh, this tool which is FIB re retracements and this is going to be giving you basically some kind of supports so they will draw you like the best areas to invest in the worst area to invest the weakest support the hardest resistance and the best area to stay at for example now this sort is at the peak of, of it so it is in the best area and in case you would like to uh, to be careful, for example, here, let me explain to you, for example, this is a support, in case it hit it and it went down, that means it could go all the way down into here. This is another support that will try to stop the graph or the candle from going all the way down. If it happened to go all the way down, that means it could hit the support and then go up a little bit, or it could go down and confirm it with another candle that will be all the way down as well. And basically, it is something like that. So the candle is here green, and then it becomes red, it goes down, and then there is a confirmation, which is a red candle as well. And then there will be like, uh, for example, this green candle, which tries to go back where it was. But sometime, as you can see here, after the confirmation, it went all the way down until here. So put that in mind, these are some very, very good uh, like uh, things to put in mind before you get to trade in. You have to really have big knowledge about trading before you get to trade in, before you get to analyze stuff. And yeah, guys, that is basically it. This is how you can connect your TradeVate account to TradingView. It is very easy, very straightforward. You have to get at least $110 between your hands, and then you can connect both applications together. So yeah, guys, that was it for today's video. If you do have any more questions, make sure to leave them down below in the comment section, and I will try to answer all of your questions. Thank you guys for watching, and see you guys in the next tutorial.